when you weren't playing football and bringing the community together, you were shooting covers of Sports Illustrated. I also read that you were spending a lot of time with some of the biggest celebrities, icons, Burt Reynolds, Elvis Presley. I just watched the Elvis Presley movie. What was it like hanging out with these type of icons as well? Well, <laughs> I was in the company of those fellows because of where I was at in uh, those folks. And uh, like with Elvis, uh, when I was with the, uh, the other league, I jumped to the uh, World League and we ended up in Memphis, Tennessee. And Elvis was a fan and he and Jim Kick got to know each other because they both liked to shoot pool. And well, I was rooming with Jim Kick at the time. So I would go over to Elvis's mansion and he and Jim would shoot pool and I'd sit over at the bar and listen to him BS. And we started to know Elvis other than just as a TV uh, rock and roller. He was into football. He liked football, liked to talk football, liked to shoot pool, liked to play eight ball. And he was uh, had some really good questions. I could tell from his questions a couple of times he asked me about different things in football. I knew that he had taken part or played or been involved in it from his questions because they were uh, they were reflective of somebody that knew a little something about football. That's great. I love that little tidbit of Elvis. Who knew that? He's not just sh shaking that pelvic and hips, but he was actually a true fan. <laughs> interesting. He's guy. a whole nother guy. There is a whole nother guy there that was a very and a, and a real guy. I mean, real down to earth and uh, as crazy as he used to act. You know, that was all. Uh, well, that was his deal. That was his. Come on. But there's there's another whole person there that's a pretty deep thinking, intelligent, nice guy. That's very cool.